Hi there everybody, Cromat here with iSkySoft Video Editor for Macintosh and today we're going to be showing you how to add background music to your videos. So I've launched the software here, I'm going to click open and open my recent project that I've used in the last couple of videos here with iSkySoft. And click that green arrow and again I'll bump up to full screen. So in the previous lesson I deleted all of my prior audio. So now I just have silent video, turn that all the way up. And what I'm going to be doing now is just bringing in some additional footage here, some additional music. I could do this one of two ways. I can add audio files by pressing Apple F and then add in some music there as I see fit, uh, defaults to picking it from the iTunes media library. But in this case, what I'm going to be doing is using a selection of the exemplary and uh, really nicely provided actually um, audio tracks here. So um, as ever with uh, Video Editor, you just double click in order to preview. Here we have just a bunch of really solid stock audio tracks here. Okay. I'm going to take this nice and uplifting and I'm just going to drag and drop that onto my timeline. I could also do this by right clicking or control clicking going apply. Uh, I like this track so I'm also going to add it to my favorites. So next time, there we go, I can just do that and it's in my favorites folder. Okay, so as I play through this now, excellent, I now have Excellent, so that plays through in conjunction with uh, my video. I'm then going to just split the audio at any position. Just split it here, I know it's wrong. Select the second half, press delete in order to delete the rest of that track, and then just drag the existing track until it snaps to the end. That will um, restore the part that I deleted before. Meaning you can just split anything where you want it to be split and then just uh, drag and extend it until it's the right length. I'll double click on this and just put in a fade in and fade out of 0.9 seconds there. And I bring the volume down to 76. Why not? There we go. So that's going to make sure that is music that's sitting in the background rather than being at the forefront of the video. I want the video to speak for itself with just a bit of music in the background to help. Okay, I'll save that. And there you go. That is a brief guide on how to add background music to your video using iSkySoft Video Editor for Macintosh. Thanks very much for watching. Speak to you next time.